ice dams, an inevitable problem we have living in New England. If you think all that icicles are, are just to look pretty, you're going to have a bad time. Heavy icicles can rip the gutters right off the side of your roof, but we're also concerned about the long damage of ice freezing on your roof. Ice dams are formed when melting water that hits a warm roof melts and then gets into the eaves and then freezes on the, on the cold surface. Water, when it melts, then gets backed up and will continue to freeze. What happens is that when the water freezes and melts again, it can't exit the roof, so it's going to find its way under your eaves and get into your house one way or another, causing significant long-term damage. Uh, a couple ways to prevent this, you know, heated cables are one, a roof rake's another, um, but long-term solutions are ridge venting and insulation in your attic. And that's why when your home inspector tells you your attic temperature is supposed to be relatively the same as the outside, this is to cease that warping and actually keep things stable. So when the ice melts, it gets off the roof, it doesn't freeze, and then you're not going to have the long-term damage. Uh, it might be beneficial to contact a roofer or contractor to have a plan initiated when we're getting a lot of snow, like the storms of January and February 2015. So in this way, when you do have all that snow accumulating on your roof, you have a plan of mitigation immediately to get it down.